Hello, hello everyone. My name is Christina and welcome to my crazy days. So I just finished taking uh, my second final for uh, my classes that I'm taking and I was excited because I received something in the mail today and it's right here. It is my succulent studios box. <laughs> This is one of my favorite boxes that I get and they've actually changed up um, their packaging and right here it says a uh, new BBS um, I don't know I don't know what that means um, maybe like better box shipping I don't know but this um, I went into my account and I checked and I have had thought I've had this box for a shorter amount of time than I actually have had it. I've had it for um, like a year and a half now, and it's amazing how time flies by. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. Oh, wow. The, so they've completely redone the box again. So this will be like the third variation of boxes that I've received from them. So you open it up and it says, thank you. And then you tip it this way and your little guys in here are saying hi. <laughs> so um this looks like i know they've been messing around to try and find like the perfect shipping boxes for these and these guys have not moved around at all in here um so it looks like this little cutout right here holds their little pots in nicely and this also you can see so i good thing i looked this has a toothpick sticking out through it so that'll also help protect uh, prevent it from moving so I'm just gonna remove this little toothpick kind of just toss it in there and then we're just gonna pull down right there and there they are oh nice okay let's see what you guys are doing here so if you look in the back back here there's these nice little indents and there's a lip right there that the pot will sit under as well so it really prevents it from moving around in there okay so this is probably the box um, the first box that i've received in a couple months where they just haven't fallen out but it's okay if they fall out because you can just stick them back in there and they'll be fine but you also get two cards <laughs> um, one for each plant gives you some information what they like bright light shade and then about how much water they need to get and it looks like these are from uh, the same family species. I've always been horrible with that. <laughs> but um, they are both um, e Echeveria plants. So we've got the Echeveria pearl and the Echeveria rosy. And okay, I love this because I can already tell which one is which just because the pictures here show me um, the different petals that they're going to have are their leaves. So this one right here is the Echeveria rosy. It's beautiful. Uh, okay, I haven't received anything like this. Last month um, I received um, a duplicate that I've already uh, received in the past. And that's fine. Um, but this month I've gotten two different ones that I've never even seen these before. Like, hmm. They just smell like plants. So they do have this little um, like hay type of thing on there to keep the moisture in. And this one's really cute. I like the little rosy tips on there. Um, it says succulents um, with a chalky blue gray leaf. The tips of the leaves are wavy and edged in that rosy pink. So let's see if you can a little closer. There you go, you can kind of see it right up and especially right there on this guy. That rosy pink. And they're slow growers, which I am fine with. I don't like when they take over so fast. And it also says one of my favorites, set and forget about it. <laughs> so it just says put it in a windowsill, partial to full light, water it just enough to keep it from wilting um, during the colder seasons and only once a month in the summer. I love this plant. <laughs> Forget about it. Good. All right. The next one is the pearl. And this is what it looks like. It's kind of really buried in there. But you can see the coloration in there at that angle. And this one says perfect purple rosettes um, have made this one of the most popular succulents around. 
loves the intense sunlight, so it's going to love where I keep it outside. They will deepen in color from a gray purple ooh, to a bright pink purple. Oh, I can't wait to see that. Um, very low maintenance, propagates easily. When the leaves start falling off, I'll have more. Um, partial to full sunlight and water once a month. So this is going to be, both of these are going to be perfect for my collection. And this is why I love this box so much. I get new succulents a month, two new um, succulents a month. And in the year and a half that I've had this box, actually it's been over a year and a half when I checked, I've only received one duplicate. So uh, my grandmother got me hooked on this. My mom has continued my obsession with succulents and I, I just love them. I can keep them alive and they're really hardy and I can just water them once a month or every other week and they're perfectly fine. So it's been a little fun thing for me to do and I hope that you guys enjoy uh, my fun little obsession with succulents. So thank you for joining me today on this video. Please hit the like button or the dislike button and please hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. It'll just help you know when I've uploaded more videos. Thank you everyone. Please stay safe out there and I will see you all later. Bye.